Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So do you have a mouse problem in your house or you've got mice around your house? If it's an issue, today I have a solution for you. This is an all natural way to get rid of mice. I've got a couple tips for you as well. So let's get started. One of the reasons why I like to use a natural deterrent for mice is because like don't ever go buy those little those little cubes that they will come in and they eat the cubes because what happens is they end up dying wherever they ate it and then you have to deal with that nasty mice smell and also here's another thing that let me tell you about this this is a true story I'm not gonna tell you who it is but they have a camper and they were putting it in storage for a little bit and they didn't want mice to get in because that happens and that's a story in itself, mice getting into your camper. So they ended up putting some of those, those little cubes, you know, to kill the mice. And what ended up happening is that it attracted more mice with those cubes because it's food. It's supposed to attract them. They had ended up having mice in their camper. They didn't know it. The mice then started chewing on some of the wires and then their whole camper ended up on fire. Like seriously, y'all, this is a true story. And so... They were without their camper, it smoked, everything got ruined. It didn't like burn down, but it did start a fire and the whole thing was totaled. So don't use those. Use this natural way because what happens with this natural way and they are going to leave the area. And that's what you want. You don't want to attract them, you want them to go. All right. So I did do a whole video on using peppermint essential oil and this actually works really well. We use this in our camper. One time we were camping in Colorado and we left it for a little bit, like we're talking three or four days and they ended up invading our camper. And I had this on hand and this worked extremely well. I also made a video on how to use that. So I'll put a link in the description box down below. Another very effective way to get mice out of your house or if you have, you know, rodents everywhere is to get a cat. They really will help keep down and just kill those mice. So even if you don't like cats, maybe you could borrow one for a little bit, but they are they are mice killers. So make sure you get one that is a mouser. Highly, highly recommend that. We've had a couple cats just show up and you know, they've stayed with us and it is really cut down on our mice problem. We have chickens and so when you have chickens, you have mice because the mice are attracted to me <laughs> the chicken feed so couple cats will definitely help with that problem all right so here is one of my suggestions to use this is the irish spring soap i know it's so crazy but this works they don't like the smell of this and they're going to flee now you cannot just use this soap whole let me show you what you need to do all right so you're going to take your soap out of the box and then get a knife and you're going to need to cut this up into pieces because that's going to really release the aroma that this Irish spring soap puts up. And so just cut it up into like little pieces right here and then you can throw this anywhere you think that the mice are getting. You can leave it on your counter in the kitchen. You can put it into your cabinet. You can put them into your attic. Put them in the trash. At least that's where my little guys like to go. I usually find them right here in the trash can. So somehow they're running back in here. And so anyways, I'll put one underneath this cabinet in here and then just put them anywhere. Attic, outside, and this is non-toxic. Well guys, I hope you found this helpful. Those are like my three tips on how to get rid of mice. Number one, the peppermint essential oils. And again, I will link that video in the description box down below. Also, get a cat. It won't hurt. Borrow a cat if you don't like cats. Totally get it. And they can live outside. They're pretty easy to take care of. And they kind of just... You know, you don't even have to feed it because they're gonna be hungry and they're gonna go look for food. And then of course the third one, the Irish spring soap. It does work because my hot water guy told me about the Irish spring soap and he was down at his hunting place and he walked in and he said it was infested with it and they threw a whole bunch of the Irish spring and the next time they came down, there was nothing. So give it a try. Try all three of these. Let me know down in the comments which one worked for you. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Be sure to hit that like button. It really helps me out, and we'll see you on the next one. Bye.